fly the flag for the British team from lane one. So only seven starters in this women's 60 metres final. And the interest really will be in that lanes three, four, five and six. It really is too close to call. So let's speak them in more detail. Asha Phillip then, the uh, UK champion, former trampolina. Terrific accident a few years ago and has done extraordinarily well to bounce back from that, no pun intended. And become a world class sprinter. Marie Jose Talu from the Ivory Coast, double African Games champion, and 100 and 200 outdoors in lane two. Elaine Thompson, world silver medalist over 200 metres in Beijing last summer. 7.04, her winning time in her heat. She was the fastest across the three semi-finals. Michelle Lee Ai pushed skippers very, very hard as well. Looking to improve on that sixth place in Sopop two years ago. There is skippers. An extraordinary transformation from a multi-eventer, a athlete into a world-class sprinter in the space of less than a year. Barbara Pierre joint world number one this year. Just being told that Dean Rasher-Smith, who uh, was due to run in uh, lane seven, has a tight hamstring. Thank you to uh, Catherine Merry, who's out in Portland, for that information, and Tori Bowie. In lane eight. So two Americans, a Jamaican, and Daphne Shippers, representing the Netherlands. Philip in one, Talu Ivory Coast in two, Thompson Jamaica three, Ai Trinidad and Tobago in four. Skippers, the pre-race favourite goes in five. Pierre from the United States in six. Tori Bowie, also from the United States, left of picture in lane eight. Set. Away they go, and again, Shippers slow out of the blocks. Pierre's on her way. Pierre, but here comes Shippers coming back, but I think she's got there. Barbara Pierre held on, but Shippers for the third time in a row. A terrible start, you have to say. Probably the worst of the three. That is a problem. And Daphne Shippers, well, she ran out of room. Barbara Pierre was out of the blocks very, very quickly, just waiting for confirmation that she held on. She was under pressure at the end but I think she's done enough. Let's look at it again, Tim, here. That's a poor start from Shippers. It's an awful start from Skippers. I mean, she just cannot come back from that. Another 50 metres she might have done, 40 metres she might have done, but uh, Barbara Pierre, a very worthy winner, even had the presence of mind to dip at the line there. But uh, Skippers, no, I don't know what was going on there. She just stood up. She was never, never at the races over the first 20 or 30. Did marvellous deeds, get back close to Pierre, but a good dip from Pierre there, and that was enough. 7.02, the winning time, just outside the world lead that she holds jointly with Daphne Skippers. Skippers having to settle for silver here in Portland on this occasion. 7.04, and Elaine Thompson taking the uh, the bronze medal at 7. Action continues, well, that's the last of the track action, remember that high jump final still unfolding.